Hmm, should be able to make a spear with this knife. Ah, that ought to do Just it. a little more. Natural, baby. Almost there. bad. That tasted like shit, man. Well, you know, it is what it is. Yeah? <laughs> and my fucking feet hurt. What about yours? Uh, I'm good. So you're a tough guy, huh? Well, it's not like we have much of a choice here. Yeah. By the way, what are you in for? Something I didn't do. So you're innocent, huh? Well, aren't we all? I'm innocent too, you know. <laughs> yeah, sure you are. What about family? You got any? Yeah. A wife. I hope. You? Me too. And a kid. Alex. Fucking missing, man. Yeah, I hear you. That piece of shit Harvey's gonna get what he deserves, let me tell you that. So, let's go after him. Together. Look, Vincent. I need to know what your story with Harvey is. Okay? <sighs> All right. I was a regular guy with a boring bank job. One day my brother brings in a new client, Harvey. Let me guess. Money laundering. Yeah. Money was easy, but Harvey just kept coming in with more and more cash, and I couldn't handle it. It was too risky, so I told him I wanted out. He killed my brother as a warning. After that, I lost it. I planned on killing him, but the son of a bitch pinned it all on me. I was convicted for the murder of my own brother. Wow. That's fucking rough, man. Yeah. Sorry. So, uh, what's your story with Harvey? 
You fucked me over, that's for sure. I mean, we were gonna... Wait, you hear that? Ah, oh, shit. We're closing in. We gotta move. Ah, oh, my fucking feet. Just suck it up. Don't worry about it, I got it, okay? So, you used to work in a bank, huh? Figures. What are you implying? Well, how should I put it? You're kinda uptight. I'd rather be uptight than a loose cannon. Thanks for the compliment. You're welcome. You know what? What? You're actually the first guy who worked in a bank that I've talked to without a gun in my hand. Would you look at that? You're making progress, Leo. Vincent, see that house? Let's check it out. Vincent, help me out here. citizen within a 50-mile radius of the prison. Don't you worry, honey. Those two fools come around here. They'll get a taste of old Betsy. Hey, I say we take them out. Are you crazy? It's an old couple. We can't do that. I don't mean it like that, man. I mean, we tied them up with something. We really need to change clothes. We can't walk around like this. I don't like it. It's better to get them out of the house. What do you have in mind? See that barn over there? Yeah. We release the horses. Release the horses? How's that gonna help? Trust me. They'll be forced to go get them back. I don't know, man. Sure, whatever, man. Let's try it. Okay, come on. Oh, yeah. How do you know they got horses in there? It's a horse barn, Leo. What else should they have? But still, you sound so sure. I mean, it could also be empty. You hear that? Yeah, I do. Hey, look up there. An opening. Maybe we can find some way to reach it.
That was easy. Now, where are the horses? There are the horses. I'm not sure about this, but let's release them. One down, two to go. Yep. Let's free them all. Hmm. Time to scare the horses. Nah, not gonna work. I wonder if I can scare a horse with this. Maybe this is too much. Nope. Not loud enough. Hey, move it. What's wrong with this lamp? Come on, you piece of shit lamp. It's locked. Can't open this one. Vincent, this might be able to scare the horses. Vincent, come on. I can't do this by myself. Come on, Vincent. Escaping, honey. Oh dear, didn't we lock the barn? Of course I did. Come on, let's go. See, I told you. Yeah, let's just hope these horses keep running. They will. We could light a fire if we put some of this wood in there. Hey, this should be enough. Let's change clothes. Let's make it nice and cozy. Here we go. Yeah, this will do. And the shotgun might come in handy. Always found these kind of soothing. If only the cell beds were this comfortable. Shit! I've never really been a hat man. Huh. Looks better than expected. Crap! There's no way I can't you believe these that. were actually used in wars. I knew it. It's only decorative. Hello. 
Hello? Hello? Vincent, is that you? Oh, shit. This is getting pretty high. Why the hell did I come up? Let's get this spinning. What a throw. Yes. I was born to do this. What a throw. Yes. I'm the champion. Oh, shit. Oh, Goddamn cat. Boom! A gas canister. I bet it still has some gas. Vincent, come over here and help me out. Hey, Vincent, get over here. I need some help. <sighs> oh, my God, it's a piece of junk. It's not that bad. What do you mean it's not that bad? Hey, it's even missing wheel. Nah, I'm sure there's a spare around here somewhere. I don't know, man. It's not like we have a choice. Sherby's running on foot. Let's fix it up, and we'll be out of here in no time. <sighs> All right, fine. It looks like the battery is out of juice. This could probably lift the car. Ready, Leo? All right, Tyre, here I come to school you. Hey, there's a tire on the other side of the barn. Battery seems dead. <gasps> okay, now we just need to squeeze. We can use stuff. this to fasten a new tire. Okay, done. Now we need something to lift up the pickup to remove the support. Ah, 
it's stuck. I guess we'll need to lift up the car before we're moving this. Great. The car has four wheels now. That's a good start. It's filled up with gas. Wonder if it will start. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What happened? Did you let go? I don't let go. Did you let go? Whatever. Let's go get it. Looks like the battery is out of juice. Might as well help them out. Jumper cables, perfect. Let's pop the hood and try them. It's connected. Try to start the car now. actually work this piece of junk. Yeah, I told you so. It did, but still, I was in doubt. Sometimes you just gotta have a little faith in things, Leo. Faith, huh? Yeah. Well, let's get out of here. Yes? No, I don't know. It was a while ago. We need your help now, officer. Okay, hurry up, please. Absolutely. Thank you. Are the police on their way yet? Yes, they'll be here any minute. Okay, I'll go take care of them. No, just stay here. It's all right, just wait here. I'll be fine. Filthy scum! Oh shit, take cover! You're gonna pay for this! Come on, let's go! Yeah. You got it! Come on, come on! Yeah. Come on! Go, 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 go! Damn it! We got cops coming! Step on it! Uh, can't this piece of shit go any faster? Just sit down, Leo! You're gonna fall off! All right! Here we go! Here they come! Hold on back there! Just focus on driving, man! I'll keep them off my back! Damn it. Here we come! Hold on back there! Just focus on driving, man! I'll keep them off our backs! Don't you dare come close to Out of the way! Out of the way! 
going. I'm not giving it that easy. Where the hell does this river take us? I have no idea, but the further away, the better. Yeah, I guess you're right. All right, start rowing. We need to get going. Hey, Vincent. Yeah? I think I saw something in the water. It's probably a shark, Leo. What do you mean? There are no sharks in this water. How do you know? It's sweet water. You're a clever guy, Leo. But I really saw something, though. Probably a fish. Yeah, whatever. A fish. Probably salmon. You know what? It could have been a crocodile. Seriously? I don't like crocodiles. Well, watch out, then. Hey, Vincent. Yeah? You think there are any bears in these woods? There are probably bears in these waters, Leo. Ha! <laughs> like I'd believe that. Looks like our peaceful boat ride is over. Some rough streams ahead. Oh, 
Watch out, some rough streams up ahead. Keep it sharp, right? Wouldn't it be fast if I just jumped in and swam? Yeah, sure. You try that. I'll just stay in the boat. I think we're through the worst of it. The rest is just a smooth ride. I think you spoke too soon, Leo. Look straight ahead. Holy shit! Done yet? Okay? I'm okay. Let's get out of here. All right. What of you, huh? Yeah. So? What happens now? Look, I know what you're thinking, but going after Harvey won't be easy. I know, but I'm going after him, with or without you. You want to end up dead? I want him gone. He's a cold-blooded killer. The world's gonna be a better place without him. You never told me, Leo. What is your story with Harvey? Before I got busted, me and Harvey made a huge score. Bang job? No. You ever heard of a Black Orlov? Are you serious? The diamond? How the hell did you pull that off? A lot of planning and a bit of luck. 
So what happened? Everything was going our way. We even had a buyer. But that greedy fuck had other plans. It's all there. Count it. Looks about right. Mm. Of course it is. You can always trust me. No, I'm not trusting nobody, my friend. There you go. What do you think? Uh, it's heavier than I thought. It is. Pleasure doing business with you guys. You too. Give me the case! What the fuck are you doing? Give me the fucking case, Leo! Hand it over, now! This is nothing personal, it's just business. Give me the briefcase. Next thing I know, I'm surrounded by cops. That's rough. I'm sorry. Oh, trust me. He's the one who's gonna be sorry. I'm making things right for me and for my family. Hmm. So do you know where Harvey is right now? I know one of his guys, Ray. He'll know for sure. So? What are we waiting for? Let's go after him. You really want to take Harvey down, huh? Like I said, with or without you, I'm going after him. Okay. All right. Where can we find this Ray guy? Don't worry, he's gonna be easy to find. But I need to make sure my family's safe first. Of course. Let's go. Don't go too far, Alex. What is it, honey? What's wrong? Oh, shit. Alex? Alex! Leo. Can I ask you something personal? Yeah, sure. How do you and your wife manage to stay together in this line of work? We've always been together. You know, she knows me better than I know myself. I was 12 when we met at the orphanage. Orphanage? You could say that my parents didn't do their job. I'm sorry to hear that. Don't be. 
I barely remember them. Besides, I was fortunate enough to have Linda. She was crazy. You know, we used to run away together, steal ice cream, cigarettes, shit. It's always been us against the world. Still is, no matter what. That's just how it is. Sounds great. an eye out for my family. It's a woman and a boy, about this size. You don't know where they live? They had to move while I was inside. I see. Let's just have a look around. I'm sure we'll find them. Yeah. Life looks